day, right day. I haven't been able to sleep all night. I'm so excited for our play date. Look at the time. Time flies. It flies. Where is my clothes? Got to work with what I have. So let's see. Two bottom and three top. I choose this style. There are three tops and two bottom outfits. For each top, there are two choices of bottom outfits. Using the fundamental counting principle, we would multiply three by two, which makes six. The reason why we multiplied three and two is because if one event can occur in M ways and another event can occur in N ways, then the number of ways that both events can occur is M times N. So we multiply three tops by two bottoms to make a total of six choices of outfits. Hey guys! Ooh, Karis brought Scrabble today. Let's play that. Oh, psh, I'm so pro at this. I'll show you guys my skills. Oh, there's so many ways to order this stupid word banana. So, out of six total letters, we're picking six to order. So that's six PR six. Permutations are the ordering of objects. So six PR six means out of six total objects, we are ordering six objects, or letters in this case. The normal method of calculating permutations of NPR comes with this equation. This symbol is a factorial symbol. So this is read as three factorial. The factorial is defined by this equation here. For example, three factorial is three times two times one, or six. So the number of permutations or orders of n distinct objects is n factorial. So back to sorting banana. We would use 6 factorial, and that would make 720. 720 different ways of arranging the letters in banana. See? Stacy, honey, you're wrong. Don't you see that the word banana has repeating letters? In your way of permutations, you're also ordering the repeated letters N and A when they really have no distinction between the same letters. So, you have to divide 6 factorial by 3 factorial and 2 factorial. 3 factorial for 3 repeated A's and 2 factorial for 2 repeated N's. The formula for permutations with repetition is N factorial over S1 times S2 times SK factorial. The number of distinguishable PR of N objects where one object is repeated S1 times, S2 times, and so on is that formula. Oh, my bad, my bad. That makes much more sense now. The concept of permutations and factorials can be used in everyday life. <laughs>